Hey guys, Latwana Stevens here, the eczema expert. And today I'm gonna to talk about a subject that's really close to my heart. And I'm actually a little floored um, about some of the information and some of the things I've been seeing out there on the internet. So I'm gonna, um, it may sound like I'm a little angry, but not at you guys. I'm just really, I gotta get my point across. So we're gonna talk about bleach and the fact how it affects eczema and I cannot believe that I'm reading on these groups out here that pediatricians are actually telling parents to bathe their kids in a bleach bath and that's going to help them with their eczema. So I need you guys, my audience, to stay with me here. This is Clorox bleach, right? Safety cap is closed, safe for your kids can't get into. I'm just going to read some facts on this bleach. It says, precautionary statements, hazards to humans and domestic animals. Now, they say give your kids a bath in it, you know, two to three times a day, and that's going to help them cure their, you know, their eczema. Um, I think we're all humans. And then it also says causes irreversible eye damage and skin burns, harmful if swallowed. If on skin, take off contaminated clothing and rinse immediately. Contact poison control. This is what the medical professionals out here are telling us to do with our precious loved ones, and that's telling them to give them a bath in bleach. I was floored when I heard that information. So I wanted to bring it to you guys and see what you thought about this. I want to read you guys some information, some critical information that's really important about bleach. It says here, I'm going to refer to my notes, chlorine bleach is a pesticide. And if you are bathing your kids and putting a pesticide in your laundry, no wonder our kids today have and suffer with some serious things like eczema, asthma, allergies, and respiratory issues. You know, each year over 1 million children are accidentally poisoned in the home. Now we're still talking about Clorox bleach. According to the material safety data sheets in the National Poison Control Centers, bleach can cause severe eye injuries, can damage the mouth, throat, and stomach, and can produce asthma-like symptoms and damage eyes and skin. Also, mixing with other chemicals can produce deadly fumes. Did you guys get that? Deadly fumes. Again, they're telling us to bathe our kids in bleach and it's going to help them cure their eczema. When on the bottle it says it's hazard to humans and domestic animals. Also, according to the National Poison Control Center, vapors have been shown to interfere with brain function and aggravate heart conditions and asthma. This is what we have, you know, around our kids, our loved ones. This is what pediatricians tell us to do. You know, would you take a, beach, a bleach bath? Better yet, how about the pediatricians? Would they take a, you know, a bath in bleach? I don't think so. So this is highly dangerous, folks. It is highly caustic, and it's just not good to have in your home. Um, below this video, you know, I have a written testimony from one of my best customers. Uh, his name is Anton Foote, and I want you guys to take a look at that and see the pictures of his, at that time, his daughter was one years old, and she, I want you to see the effects that bleach had on her life. And I think you'll really get the picture when you take a look at that. So I just want to thank you for watching um, this video. And remember, you know, pass this on to anyone that you know that's affected with eczema. Or if you've heard, you know, people or you yourself, if you're giving your kids a bath and bleach, just really take notice and really ask yourself, should I be, you know, should I be doing that? So I hope you really learned something today. I hope this information was helpful. You can visit me on my blog at latwanisstevens.com. You can also hear my personal story with my child um, at www.treatingskineczema.com. And you can also get my book that's available at treatingskineczemaguide.com. So again, thanks everyone. Hope you learned a lot today and I'll see you next week.